Many years ago, I was in Kaver Rachel. I was davening by Kaver Rachel. I don't remember what, what, what day it was. It was that night davening by Kaver Rachel. And I don't remember if I missed the bus, the last bus, or I didn't want to wait for the bus because they said then at 45 minutes, whatever it was. So I decided that I was going to hitch home from Kaver Rachel to where I lived at that time. And when I was in Eretz Yisrael, I lived in Machal. I'm going to hitch. Now you obviously want to be careful when hitching from Kaver Rachel because it's a dangerous neighborhood. You want to you want to hitch from within the walls, you know, because you never know who picks you up. You know, so we want to avoid that. So I was hitching, and I finally, Baruch Hashem, we had a guy come and you know, from guy, Yeshiva Shi guy, came to pick me up, get in the car. If I where are you going? I'm like, oh, <laughs> they didn't say it like that. He's like, if I where are you going? I'm like, whoa. Anyways, I said I'm going to Machal. He said, oh, very good. I live in uh, Ramat Shlomo, if I remember correctly, Ramat Shlomo, maybe. And uh, I'll take you right there. I'll take you right to Machal. I'm like, Ramat Shlomo, Machal, uh, you know, it's not really on your way. If you could just drop me off at the Kfish, that would be quite fine for me. And I, I could walk. You know, it's not too far. Or I could take the train. You don't have to take me all the way. It's out of your way. So he looks at me. And, and I remember this line cha- it literally changed my perspective of life. He's like, it's not out of my way. I'm like, it's out of your way. If I'm going left, and you're going right, and you're going to do me a favor and go left, <laughs> instead of going right, that's out of your way. You could say, even though it's out of my way, I'll take you. No, I'll do a chesed. But don't say it's not, it's not, you know, it's not, in your, it's not out of your way. It is out of your way. So he looks at me, and he says, it's not out of my way. So I repeat it. I'm like, <clears throat> I literally just said a second ago that if we're going left, it's out of your way. He said, it's not out of my way because you think my destination is Ramat Shlomo. You think my destination is my house. And in Echanami, if that was my destination, then Taka, taking you home, doing this chassad is out of my way. But that's not my destination. My destination is Olam Haba. And dropping you off at your house is exactly on the way to my destination. And I was blown away. I was like, dude, what is your name? I was literally blown away. I was like, wow, who thinks like that? Who thinks that to take you somewhere, even though it's out of my way, is not out of my way? Because we, where, where is my way? Well, I'm looking at the Traklin. I'm looking at Olam Haba Gan Eden, And everything that I'm going to be doing as a chesed is exactly on the way to that destination. That, that's what gets me there. If I don't do this chesed, how am I getting to my real destination? Yeah, I'll get to the Mount Shloma, but then what? It's such a game changer. Sometimes in life we think that we're going out of our way when little do we realize that this is our way. <laughs> if not for this action that we're about to do, then Taka on the way we would have uh, who knows what. This is what saved us. This is what got us there. Sir, you're going out of your way. No, I'm not. My way is Olam Habo.